I'm excited to come to you. I, one, confirm if you can hear me. That is the first thing we do when we come here. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Because in my previous live stream, you people could not hear me. So I wanted you guys to confirm for me. Can you hear me? And then we can continue with today's updates. Yeah. Thank you so much as you come in. Remember to hit the like button. Thank you so much for your continued support. Yeah. Can someone confirm to me that you guys can hear me? That's all. Type in the comment section that you can hear me. You can't hear me? There is a live. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Can you hear me? No, I have four people who have joined the live stream. Yeah. Oh, yes, you can hear me. Thank you very much. Yes, I needed that confirmation and then we can get into today's uh, discussion. Hello, how are you? Thank you so much for joining. And thank you so much for all the people who have joined the community. I am so, so happy to have you. I am coming to you from Addis Ababa. And I'm happy for us to have a conversation to keep updating, updating each other to see what is going to be happening very, very soon. And just to have a chat and to hear from you. Hi, hi, thank you so much for joining. I'm so happy to have all of you. We, uh, you can also visit the Southern Ethiopia. It's, a it's also a beautiful place. Oh, thank you, thank you so much. Hey, hey, thank you very much. As you come in, let me know where you're watching me from and we can continue having an interesting discussion here. Henok, thank you so much. Hey, Dama, hey, how are you? I'm doing good, hi everyone. Thank you everyone for joining yes hit the like button as you come in and let me know from where you are tuned in i am tuned in from i've sent you an email yes i know i have seen that and i have replied i'm going to confirm to you in just after this live i'm going to get back to you no problem and we can see what can work out thank you very much and uh, yeah so guys i'm looking forward to visiting awasa just for anyone who's coming here for updates where are you going next I am looking forward to visiting Awasa and maybe I will visit the south and when I go to the south it could be signs for me to go back to my country. So you guys, I really wanted to go to South Sudan but I'm told it's impossible for me to go from Addis to South Sudan. I really wanted to meet someone there but I'm told it's not possible. So if you have any updates on the condition of South Sudan, the road especially, let me know. If you have any knowledge about war, about safety, anything, let me know. Like Wondogen, Arbaminch, Hawasa. Okay, I will visit all these places and I will bring to you. Thank you guys also for watching my videos. You guys have been loving my how uh, the uh, Epiphany video has really been doing well and uh, what $10 can bring you here. Oh my God! and we just received a, a super chat watching from Chicago $10 from uh, let me get closer and read your name uh, Kemi thank you very much I greatly greatly appreciate yeah. cheers for that yeah for anyone wondering what I'm drinking it's a Buna drink I'm grateful thank you so much for your support your support has been so major, you guys, this year that I am so, so grateful. And I really look forward to much growth. I look forward to just so many things and us exploring different places. As I identify, wish I send a dollar if I have. Oh, thank you. Your support is greatly appreciated. I really appreciate. Did you eat injera? No, today I have not eaten in Jara. Today I have actually visited one place that was well, well, well organized by one of you guys who watched my video. And it was, it was some international food. I love calling it international because you can't like group it to a certain country. So it was some chicken and um, pasta. That's what I ate today. Yeah. And this is for anyone who might be in... Addis and you're looking for like a good hotel because I've really really struggled to find good internet for us to go live and for us to have a conversation you can come at Sapphire Hotel and enjoy some 
good internet, pretty fast internet. Uh, injera, I've not eaten injera. Actually, I've not eaten injera for the last like two or three days. I have been on a break from injera. Hey, George. Hello, how are you? You've been one of my biggest supporters from I think when I had very, very, like I think 10 or 30 subscribers. I have always seen your comment. I'm grateful. It has been a journey. We are still on the journey. Okay, yeah, we are still on the journey. Uh huh. Anyway, I'm very, very grateful for all of you guys. Your suggestions are really appreciated. If you have any question, I will gladly. Oh my God, I will greatly answer. Yeah. Uh, um, next month in Addis Ababa. Welcome, Yoni. You're going to love it here. I've been in Kenya for nine months in Karyoko, Nairobi. I love Kenya from Ethiopia. Thank you very much. Yeah, Ethiopia. It's good to visit Kenya. Kenya is a good country also. Uh, so this is what my plan is. I really don't... Uh, if I go to the south, I will proceed and go back to my country. And then from there, we will see where else we are going to go. But if that's not the case, um, I still have like one more call to make and I'll be certain if I'm doing the South Sudan option or not. Because so far none of you guys has told me anything about it. Oh, it is too weird. I wish I help you. There are lots of places in Addis having a very fast Wi-Fi up to 15 Mbps. I wish, yeah, I have struggled, especially close to Bole today because the place I stay in is close to Bole. I have struggled. Now, I also want to apologize for anyone who really wanted to come and join the live stream, but they are going to watch this after. Uh, immediately I found good internet. I was just like, just do this. It was, I have just been wanting to go live, but I have not been sure. I have been having Wi-Fi, but the speeds are terrible. Like even the place I stay, they have Wi-Fi, but it is not good speed. It can't do Wi-Fi live. We are just going to be buffering the entire time. But I'm happy, yeah. Uh, not for nine months. I said for nine years and I miss Sukumawiki. Oh, sorry, sorry. I'm very sorry. I read nine years in my head, but I maybe I said nine months. I'm sorry. Yeah, nine months. Nine years is a good, is a long time. You are Kenyan. If you stayed in my country for nine years, you are Kenyan. Thank you. Yeah. Which is actually a very, very good thing. Uh, my wish and my hope is I can also continue exploring Ethiopia because Ethiopia has been good to me. We will see about that. And we keep seeing what else we can do. We keep adventuring. We keep majorly just doing our best to bring good content. Let me say that for now. There is 15 Mbps in Skylight Hotel, the biggest hotel in Addis, and also the best hotel explore. Uh, it's near Bole Airport. Are you drinking Buna with a glass? <laughs> you want me to drink Buna with the bottle? Okay, I will do that. But wait, let me master the Skylight Hotel. Skylight Hotel has 15 Mbps. Skylight Hotel. Okay. Are you drink? Yes, let me show you. This is what I'm drinking. And I can still drink it with the glass. So I really love this drink because it has coffee and and because it does not have alcohol that's why I love it. It is nigus or buna. Oh, nigus or buna. Okay, fine. Thank you. Thank you now. You're trying you're trying chat eating chat it's just a little i tried uh if you watched my video in the island you will see i chew chat for just one leaf i didn't even like finish i miss tasca beer and gnama or oh, and nyamachoma also oh my god ah i miss nyamachoma mostly but at least i can also find nyamachoma here i say not 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 or okay that's fine i got it i just thought you're drinking coffee not buna mm -hmm. Oh, I get you. No, 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 no. It's not coffee. It's it's the malt drink. Nakupenda sana safadali. 
Uh, ni wewe tafadhali. Oh my god. Who says that? Lante. Okay, send your CV and then we can see what. <laughs> uh, welcome to Bardake Konjo. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I have already visited Bahda enough time. I have even shot and said it is my favorite city in Ethiopia. And now it's time for me to see what Addis has in store. Um, you guys have really requested for me to go to Entoto Park, for me to go to Unity Park. I will, I will see if that's possible. But I really want to see what is this thing that is there that people really want me to go there. Because after I've asked a few like Ethiopians what is at Entoto Park, they just tell me it's activities that just lead me to use money. But anyway, we will see about that. You're an inspiration to all other Africans. Today is such a very, very good live. We have that two people in the live stream. We have a super chat there. Please hit the like button. Uh, visit Eritrea Asmara. I met an Eritrean, but they told me that Eritrea is closed. The border is closed because of COVID. So not possible for me to visit Eritrea, but I look at it positively. It's another chance for me to take a road trip from Kenya when like... There is peace now in Ethiopia, from Kenya to Ethiopia to Eritrea to Djibouti to Sudan. That will be an interesting road trip and maybe to Egypt. Oh my God. Uh, talking about that just gives me so much life. Asmara is little Italy. Yeah, I've seen that on videos. Damn. Okay, would you mind to tell us about your personal affairs? If not, please. What personal affairs do you want to know? I'm okay telling you whatever personal affairs you want me to know. Where you been apart from Ethiopia? Apart from Ethiopia, you can actually check in my playlists. I have like playlists for videos in, uh, in my country, Kenya, in Rwanda, in Uganda, in uh, Burundi, and in Tanzania. You can check those videos on... You can check those videos and you will be able to see. Oh, do it and vlog. Where you been apart from Ethiopia? Do it and vlog it. Okay. Did you say dam? Where is dam? I don't get it. Oh, Asmara is little Italy. I will see. When the time to go to Eritrea comes, I will definitely go there. Right now, as I told you guys, it's not possible for me to go to Eritrea because they have close their borders as far as I was told by an Eritrean. So what did you study? Or where are you originating originally from? I am originally from Kenya, born in Kenya, lived in Kenya, educated in Kenya, and now it's time for me to get out of Kenya and see the world. Um, what do you study? Uh, currently, I am, I am aspiring to do my master's, but before that, I studied, I have a degree in computer science, so things to do with coding, programming, uh, things to everything to do with computer that you can study. I like Nairobi. Many Eritreans live there. Yeah, many Eritreans live there together with the Ethiopians and mostly at Isili in Nairobi. Uh, hit that like button, guys. Yes, guys. Hit that like button. Computer science is good. We need you in Eritrea. Oh, thank you very much. Maybe one day. Maybe one day we can see what we can do. What kind of phone do you use? I use Samsung A30. Samsung A30 is what I use as of now. Which country are you really like the most? I mean, you visited so far. The country I live in... Uh, okay. Before I came to Ethiopia, Rwanda was my very, very favorite country because, uh, because of one thing, the safety. The safety in Ethiopia, in Rwanda, you don't have to think about your phone. You don't have to think who will grab me as I am doing, I don't know what. So Rwanda was actually basically my favorite country. But when it comes to the goodness of people and even people I have interacted with, so far I am in love with Ethiopia. They have like good people when you think in terms. So for me, uh, I can divide it in those two, two ways. Uh, collaboration one day. I don't mind collaboration. Hit me up. I'm looking forward to collaborate with anyone who is up to collaborate. And yeah, guys, hit the like button as you continue coming in. I'm gonna say you're paving the way for other African youths to visit Africa by Africans. We need more like you. Thank you very much. I would say uh, I highly recommend and I highly encourage anyone who gets a chance to visit anywhere 
uh, in Africa, even out of Africa, you take up the chance. But for majority of Africans, they always look into going like out of Africa, which is okay. But also visiting African country is okay because you get to have like a different perspective and different experience. Like for me, before I came to Ethiopia, I didn't know like it's different completely from Kenya. And it's like, it like gives me this whole different experience. So yeah, I would advocate for so many people to visit other places. May Jesus unite us. For sure, may Jesus unite us. What do you like most from Ethiopia? What do you dislike also? Tell us honestly. Uh, what I like most is people are very hospitable. People are very willing to help. Uh, I like that about Ethiopians. So what I dislike is, I don't really dislike because that is who they are, but what doesn't work to my advantage is the fact that they speak Amharic only, like majority of people don't speak English. But as I said, that has nothing to do with me. That is how Ethiopians should be, because the difference is what makes us unique. So I wouldn't say I dislike it. Uh, but some of, uh, I've not seen like major things that I really dislike, but like small things. And I have a list of things I'm compiling on some things I hate and some things I love about Ethiopia. So stick around, I, I will release that video. And uh, how long have you been blogging? Oh my God, that's an interesting question. I have been blogging since 2018 officially. Uh, wait 2018 is when i started and then 2019 i got very serious about it 2019 i hustled so hard and 2020 i started traveling and 2021 here we are okay i have been traveling all through my blogging concepts but living out of the country seriously was in 2020 yeah. you are so beautiful thank you very much i greatly appreciate thank you which nationality has most handsome guy in my opinion? Ha. Huh. In my opinion, I would say uh one, let me first say that there are very very beautiful ladies in Ethiopia. That goes by fact. Being a Kenyan, I admit with that. <laughs> I agree. for me I think Ethiopian ladies are very beautiful, but you asked about men I've also seen some handsome men in Ethiopia compared to other countries that I have visited. But let's keep traveling and then with time I will answer that question better. I want to go to Kenya for Gulathion injection. What is, uh, what is glu Gulathion injections? Please, let me know what is that. Eritrea and Kenya flight is expensive. Yeah, it's expensive. You're still in Ethiopia? Yes, I'm still in Ethiopia right now. I am in Addis. You are charming and encourage other Africans to know more about themselves. African, thank you, thank you very much. Do you plan to go to the Somali region? Ha. Huh. So going to Somali, many people have really discouraged me from going to Somali. And yep, 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 today we made it to 51 people on my live stream. Yay! I think that's a record we are breaking. Uh, I will certainly go to... Somali one day. This is to prepare anyone who might tell me not to, but one day I will. So at the moment I had planned to consider trying and visit Somaliland, but let's go slow. And the COVID situation is giving me lots of stress because when I think about going to another country, now I have to think about how much COVID I have to test. And when you talk about COVID test, that is more money. And then you also have to think about uh, I also have to think about visa. I was okay thinking about visa and everything. So first, let's see how the vaccination story goes on. And then after that, we can consider just being spontaneous on visiting any country. Kenya have the best whitening spa stores. Yes, there are very, very good spas, good massage areas and places in Kenya. I totally agree. Uh, uh, Suki Beauty showed us. Okay, that's fine. I am from Las Vegas. Good to see you. Thank you very much. Thank you for being here. I am from Saudi Arabia. Thank you very much. You're so beautiful. I greatly appreciate. Thank you all of you guys for being here. Eritrean Habesha is handsome. Oh, you mean Eritreans are more beautiful? Okay. Okay. Nice to meet you, my friend. Thank you very much. All the new people joining my live stream, all the people joining my community and this 
adventure journey. I am forever grateful. Welcome, feel at home, feel so much loved, feel so much appreciated. Thank you for your comments. I read all of your comments. I'm still trying to catch up on replying on your comments, but my number one goal right now is to try and upload more videos to entertain you, just in case you wonder why I did not reply to your comments, but I try and leave a like, okay? Yeah, Damaris, are you visiting Entoto Park? And the not uh, under net park and Gulele Garden. I will look into that. I will look into that. I will try my best and see if I can visit. I will try. Do you already have a, a, a Ethiopian name? Yes, I have an Ethiopian name, which means Desta. Desta means happy, and I thought that was a perfect name for me. Ah. Uh, Cut. I am glad the Ethiopian people have been so friendly for the most part of our Jenga squad, Quindi. Yes, I agree. I totally agree that people have been very, 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 very supportive and they have been very friendly. Like, for example, the guy who just found me on the street and from nowhere just decided to take me to his family. That I am forever grateful. Like, that was wonderful. Oh, whitening injection. Okay, all the best, all the best. Don't go to Somalia, you see? Many people tell me don't go to Somalia. Eritrea is safer. Yeah. So yesterday I was having a long conversation with uh, someone who actually knew me from my YouTube channel. And one thing that he really encouraged me to do is to visit more stable countries, which I thought makes more sense. So I will look into that. Uh, you never be afraid to try something new because life gets boring when you stay within the limit of what you already know. Much respect and love from Ethiopia. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. You interested in traveling outside Africa? If yes, where? Oh my God. I am interested in visiting outside Africa. I will not say that this channel, I'm just going to be visiting Africa. I am interested in visiting Bali. That is Thailand. Uh, I am interested in visiting Malaysia, Singapore, US, of course, New York City, the dream of everyone. Uh, maybe one day I can get like a, a Schengen visa, Schengen visa, what? That visa and visit Europe, that will be so good. I Wi Fi in Addis working, that's a pleasant surprise. Yes, I was surprised too. I am in this very, 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 very beautiful hotel, and this is where I'm enjoying some good Wi Fi. Will you stay in Ethiopia more? I'm still here for a few weeks or days. Yeah. Uh, what do you know about Ethiopia Airline? Do you have plan to visit to visit it? Uh, Ethiopian Airline. Okay. About Ethiopian Airline, I don't know. So far, I have only flown with Kenyan Air Airline, Kenya Airways. I have not flown with Ethiopian airline, but what I've heard from other people that is positive is that it is pretty affordable when you have like uh, transit, uh, if you want to do transit journeys. Please go to South Africa. Yes, I really want to go to South Africa. It is a dream country. Just that I have to get a visa to go to South Africa, but we will see about that. Please stay in Ethiopia. Yes, give me a house. I will stay here. Somali region and Somalia are different. Thought you were talking about Somalia. No, I was talking about Somaliland. We clean Habesha Sabans from Arabs. Okay. You should get Patreon for your travel expenses. Yes, guys, 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 guys. I hope you guys will join my Patreon account. I pray you guys will join my Patreon account. I really want to launch my Patreon account pretty soon, actually. Like in the next two days, you guys join my Patreon account. That will be very, very helpful for me in this journey. And for those who don't understand what a Patreon account is, it's a platform where you have like sort of a subscription where you get to be a part of my journeys by supporting me financially. And you getting more benefits than other of my subscribers. Like for example, uh, okay. More details in as I launch, as I launch, as I launch, because I am excited because I have different offers for you guys. And thank you so much, um, Alem, for saying that from a a Ethiopia. Thank you very much. And also my another apology. I cannot read your words, your names, because I don't really see very far. So I have to come close for me to see. And you guys don't want to just see my eyes as I read your name. So my apology. 
very very soon we will upgrade our eyes situation and we will be good to go what tourism somalia got beside pirates oh my god you barely know about somalia somalia has like one of the best beaches on earth i have watched the videos i have not been there but i have seen how beautiful the country is despite the fact that there is war the country is very very beautiful it has so much more to offer to offer uh desta conjo thank you forever grateful is it peaceful in bashda yeah it's very peaceful as far as damaris is concerned uh but i was told that in the amhara region it is not necessarily a hundred percent safe so you have to be just on your guard i also met some some people there and they had been arrested some severally because they were thought to be invigilating for the place like it's just uh, i can't a hundred percent say that ethiopia is a hundred percent safe but it is not as bad as it is portrayed by the media okay but that makes me think there's no country that is 100% safe because if i think about my country anytime you could hear there is what are they called what are they called you could hear at any point there could be some bomb somewhere or something but that that like does not happen as often so yeah yeah it is safe it is safe as far as i know i'm sure you will enjoy more go south part of ethiopian like hawasa Awasa is coming very very soon. Stick around, you will see that video very very soon. Go to Oromia, best country. Did you say best country or best side of of the place? Okay, I will see. I will see about it. Uh, Eritrea is highly stable. Yeah, my only problem that happened with Eritrea is the fact that the border is closed because of COVID. If I was flying in, that's okay, but the border is closed. Yeah, Desta means happiness. Yep, yep. Come to Eritrea. I will come to Eritrea pretty soon. Christine Gare, hi, hello, dear. Thank you. Thank you so much for joining my live stream. Happy to have you. Mm, Malaysia, so you can buy cheap hair, hair bundles. My sister went there too. Okay, yes. Yes, so I can buy hair bundles so people can stop telling me to take care of my hair. And yeah, so you guys, there has been one good... You told me not to be giving credit to haters, so we are not doing that. Indonesia, yeah, I also look forward to visiting Indonesia. Eritrean airline is the best. Okay, pick Eritrean airline. Okay, all I'm waiting for right now is someone to surprise me with that flight ticket, and I will be there immediately. A drink for that. Ah, uh, Upendo Azuri, Nanina, Pesa. <laughs> oh my god you know what this person says upendo uzuri na nina pesa like they have money and they also have love wow how old are you and you look like kikuyu aren't you okay about how old are you hmm. i'm learning to be comfortable with my age but in the moment let's make it a misery okay uh you look like kikuyu i am a half tribe of kikuyu and a masai and I love that about myself and one day I will tell you guys my Maasai name and we can stop calling me Damaris which food is your favorite in Ethiopia honestly honestly apart from meat because I love meat even from my country uh, I love injera with shro that's one good food I love pretty affordable I like it I enjoy it I can eat it every time I also love the vegetarian type of injera but it has to have shro if it has shro, I'm good to go. That is besides meat. I don't want to say meat because I love meat despite whether, regardless of the country, but I don't love raw meat. Yeah. Did you learn how to say hello in Amharic, Somalia, in Ethiopia? Yeah, I know how to say salam. I know how to say endetnesh, uh, but I forget how to reply. Matters, you're good in marketing. <laughs> okay. Uh huh. Okay, okay. Go to South South Ethiopia and Oromia. They were they more close to you. North Ethiopia, not even black. Okay, yeah. I will go to the southern part of of the place. I will join. Don't have to sub either. You can you can donate. Thank you, thank you that you will join. 
Oh my God, I'm grateful that you will join. I'm grateful. I am not in the marketing. I am life coach for Saudi. Saudi shakes. Ah, okay. I hope you use Telegram app to contact more Ethiopian fans. Ah, I'm only beginning to learn that Telegram is such a big application here in Ethiopia. I am used to using uh, WhatsApp mostly, but Telegram is such a big deal here. Hello, dear. How are you? Why don't you visit Omo Bali tribes? I am sad of that. Because I don't have the money. Honestly, I would have visited the Omo Valley for me to be able to show you guys like this concept of how they put like this thing on their lips. I also want to see that, but I need money to go there, you know? You like Ethiopian? Yes, I like Ethiopian. Why are you saying don't use E.T.? Why am I saying don't use E.T.? What does E.T. mean? Oh, I'm, I, didn't say, I didn't say don't use Ethiopian airline. I did not say that. I you you can explore with whatever I just said for me I have only used Kenyan Airways I am not also advocating for Kenyan Airways because I've not like flown enough for me to be like use this flight but I've heard about Ethiopian airline that it has very very good deals when it comes to prices uh cuz I stand with Eritrean airline you fly with Eritrean airline that's okay if someone tells you of something else that's fine I thought we were getting a kiss I'm sorry. <laughs> oh my God, I don't even know what that was, but I'm sorry. Yeah, I was just trying to see the name. <laughs> you can get a kiss too, no problem. <clears throat> to all of you, please visit Somali region in Ethiopia. I will see the possibility of that. Uh, don't be mad, we still have Besha family. Yeah, not getting mad here. Never listen to human. Listen to your heart. Go to Somali. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. That's so powerful. Yeah, I will listen to my heart. You don't even have enough food on the table. Now you're starting your thing. Wait a minute. What do you mean? What do you mean I don't have enough food on my table and I am starting my thing? Explain that. Uh, hello, my beautiful girl. Kisses and hugs from Kingdom of Bahrain. Thank you so much for being here. Greatly appreciate. What do you feel about? What do I feel about to Ethiopia? I just wish, one thing I wish about Ethiopia is that the war could come to an end. And we are 62 of us in here. That is a miracle happening. Thank you guys for being here. I really appreciate I wish you had a gimbal to stabilize your Samsung. I wish I had a gimbal too. I wish I had a gimbal too. Very soon maybe I will get one. It's good to see a beautiful girl like you from the next door visit Ethiopia and learn different culture. We Africans tend to admire for our culture, ignoring ours. Go girl. Thank you. Thank you very much. I totally agree with that. And uh, maybe with time... It could also be because uh, the world or the media has exposed the outside world, outside Africa to look very glorious beyond anything someone would want to admire. But when you start seeing, oh, there is this, there is that in African countries, you're like, okay, let me pay my flight ticket and visit Ethiopia or another African country. Uh, Aramia is independent, state, beautiful. Okay, Desta, I love it exactly expressing you so. To support your traveling expenses, make link your fund. I'm ready to support you. Thank you very much. In the meantime, for anyone who wants to support me, you can, you can, uh, you can send me your support through damarisjengayt at gmail.com. As you can see it on, on my name, it is Damaris Jenga, or as people love pronouncing it, Jenga. Why? at gmail.com I have my PayPal account with that email address or you can write me an email address and we can see how we can help each other uh, Somaliland is part of Somalia please respect okay I respect I'm okay with either I will visit whether it's part of it or not when I visit there I will have a better understanding so forgive me if I am saying something wrong that you don't agree with please add your Ethiopian name Desta in Amharic to your channel name if you do that your number of subscribers will increase a lot okay I will see I will see about that how do you like Addis Ababa 
I like Addis Ababa. I like it. It's just that I was getting disappointed with the fact that uh, I was not getting like good internet. But Addis Ababa so far, I like it. There's still not so much for me to do as a tourist, but it's a vibrant, it's a vibrant city. It has like many buildings. People are very uh, energized to work, aggressive, and to try and make ends meet. So it's good. When are you coming to Botswana? Oh my God! On my way to, I will do. One day I will do a road trip to South Africa, and on my way I will visit Botswana. I don't recognize Somalia and Djibouti as countries. I only recognize Somalia. Okay, that's according to you. But for me, I think Djibouti is a country. About Somaliland, I'm not sure. I never listen to human. Listen to your heart. Go to Somalia. Okay, I hear you. I hear you. Oromia is TPLF made borders like all the ethnic region. Okay. Matthias, try somewhere else. Not here. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. If TPLF... Oh my God, the rate at which you guys fight for me. <laughs> In the comment section, I'm just a lot like, oh my God, I am so blessed. Uh, if to be a left uh, leading Ethiopia until now, you may head or see on street while students are getting killed. Go to Abe is leading now. Okay, Djibouti is American, French, Chinese military bases. How old are you? Yeah, I said that earlier. You can... Open Telegram channel and Twitter too. They are the best platforms. Okay, I will open Telegram. I have Twitter, I will open Telegram. Ismail Bank is white power military in Africa. Oh, I don't know about Ismail Bank. Please visit Djibouti. I will visit Djibouti. I've just heard that Djibouti is very, very ex expensive. Uh, the dollar ten video in Ethiopia was great. Thank you very much. I am old enough. Yes, I am old enough. Salam, salam to you too. I just wanted to say I love you, Damari. Thank you so much, guys, for your love. Thank you so much for your continued support. Uh, Damendesh, oh, Damendesh Nesh, Dehnamin. I just know you are asking something like how you're doing. I am doing very well. I'm doing very fine. Thank you very much. That was very funny. Joshua, you jealous. Kimata, Orimia is best country. Uh uh. Everywhere is best. It is all a perspective, guys. Eritreans are fishing everywhere. Aha. Uh -huh. Lanta, what do you mean? I need you. What do you mean you need me? Explain. Okay, there is a hater. Please from there. And uh, okay, please send your contact number. You want me to send my contact number? You want me to send my contact number? Are you serious right now? I am very, very serious right now. Have a pen. I'm about to speak my my number this does not happen in any live stream i'm about to speak out my number and i will receive random calls from people is that what you want uh sister country Eritrea. our Eritrean man is prettier okay 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 i will see about that um hi can you please tell us how is the situation with great from the news i read there is a war now uh actually i've had so many not so many. There's one specific person who has been replying on all the comments. All the comments they've been talking about is about the Tigre situation. Honestly, I can, as I said, and as I responded, as I responded to them, is uh, I have no tangible information for me to say, like, or I have not witnessed or I have not seen how bad the Tigre situation is. As far as I'm concerned, I'm not well updated about that, but... Ethiopia is still safe. At least I'm still here. I would have written the title is something like we have war or something. So in the in the moment, it's not as bad as it might be portrayed. I tend to think, yeah. We find you a husband. Oh, you want to find me a husband? Wow. Okay, let's see. Let's see. You are old enough. I read that. Who cares about airlines? Okay. Hey, James. Thank you so much. Uh, Salah, there is no situation. There is peace. Okay. Yeah, you got an answer. Salam, new. You see her pretty smile. Thank you. Please visit Somaliland and Djibouti. I will visit. I'm just told it's very, very expensive, but it scared me. It honestly scared me. I was also told there is a, a train that goes to Djibouti. I will research about that, and I see the possibilities of going via road. If it is possible, I could come to Djibouti. Are you going to host me? Let me know. Do you miss Barda already? I miss some aspects of Bahra. Uh, I had good friends. I had made like very, very good friends. I miss them. Shout out to Abraham if he ever watches this video. 
uh, please visit Gonda. I already visited Gonda. Please check in my videos. You will see uh, my stay in Gonda, how I even got scammed in Gonda, how I had the best time in Epiphany. Oh, I like that. Please visit Somali region in Ethiopia. I will do that. Ethiopian cock is the best, isn't it? There is no difference. Cock is cock. Coca everywhere is coca. There's no difference. Lalante was writing it to me because he think Ethiopia paid Eritrean airline come up. I, I, I don't know. Uh, I, I, I agree with... Uh, they paid Eritrean airline. I don't have any evidence about that. We are 70 of us in the live stream. Moment of silence to celebrate. 70 people in the live stream. Thank you guys for being here. This is just me being happy. Do you have a boyfriend? No, I don't have a boyfriend as of now. I was planning to go there this summer, but I'm afraid because of the war situation. So it is normal now. Yes, everything is normal here. But I would, dis I would not discourage, but I would not. I was told when it's summer season here in Ethiopia, it really, really rains like from morning to evening. So unless you're planning to come and maybe stay with your family or something like that, around that time is not necessarily highly recommended for you to come and visit Ethiopia. The best time for you to come in Ethiopia actually is in December cr crossing to January because there's so much celebrations. People are in like this very good mood and feeling blessed and yeah, you will have a good time. Uh, I like your lips, thank you very much. Please visit Somali region in Ethiopia. If you don't use Couchsurfing app, download it now and you will have a great time at Omo Valley without paying like a tourist. The tourists stay only 30 minutes and they go, but I suggest uh, to stay two hours. So will I get like someone in Omo Valley who can host me in, in the south through Couchsurfing? Let me know. Uh, deep down you are Ethiopian. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. I appreciate the fact that people think I look Ethiopian. That is so good of them. Uh, you are right, uh, Sizuhuru. Wow. Uh, away from woman. We don't support our own herbaceous. Oh, you don't support? We just watch because we bought. <laughs> oh my God. But you know, you watching is supporting. You realize that? So, yeah. Support your own if you can. Support your own. It's a good thing. Hi. Hi. Thank you so much for being here. Down with ethic politics. Bring back the provinces. I'm not the best when it comes to politics. Please, guys, hit the like button. Hit the like button. Do you have to visit? You have to visit Unity Park. What is Unity Park? Let me know. What is this interesting thing at Unity Park? There is a charger there. Tunakupenda sana, asante, asante, nashkuru. Somaliland is now has its own independence. Okay, good to know. Hi, I am Addis. Meet me. Please, if you want, send your number. Okay, I don't know how to send my number. The only way for me to send my number is send me an email at damarisjengayt at youtube.com Not youtube.com, I'm sorry. At gmail.com or Send me a DM on my Instagram. I do reply to relatively all my DMs. Yeah. Please, but don't say hi. Just like write, hi, I'm writing to you because of this, because of this. That way it's easier. Please do that. That way I will be able to get to you. Uh, Damaris, have you visited Nazareth? Adama, Ethiopian, Nakuru. And hope you, you took some buna. I'm taking some Buna currently right now. Hello, hello, thank you so much. I hope you enjoy it and can find things to do. Hi Damaris, where in Addis are you at? Right now I am at Sapphire Hotel. This is where I am enjoying my cup of, not cup, really, uh, but my glass of Buna malt drink. Uh, Sapphire Hotel, it's in Bole, so. Huh. Yeah, that's where I am. Talk about the weather. Right now, it's been weather. It's 
the weather has been so sunny and then in the at night it gets so cold so yeah that's basically it about weather in addis and that's why i don't really love addis that much because it's so sunny during the day and very cold at night yeah uh you have to visit unity park tell me what is at unity park we love you and happy to see you there thank you so much just say dena oh dena is better okay dena wow it's impossible to understand local politics it would be nice if people would not press travelers to master the local politics it's impossible people yes thank you Kat. thank you that's why i love you you know because let's just focus um, uh, 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 there are some a few political uh, conversations about politics political channels and they really address the whole concept and yeah so i can see some of you guys are texting me on instagram and even on my email i'm going to reply to your emails today before the day ends go to israel they love kenyan and rwanda i will definitely visit israel one day are you from kenya yes i'm originally from kenya and i love it oh my god i thought you were going to give the world your number you're always scaring <laughs> Wow, Kat, I value my sleep. If I leave my number on the internet, so many people can just decide to call to confirm if it's a number that exists. <laughs> yeah, that would not be very, very wise. Hi, are you in Addis now? Meet me, send your number. I told you guys, I am at Sapphire. Uh, I'm at Sapphire in Bole. So if you can meet me up there, that's where I am. Don't forget to use your bargaining power with taxi drivers. Whoop, whoop. Yes, I remember. Uh, you can go to Djibouti by Ethiopian train. I had confirm with me. Does the train really work or is it broken? Let me confirm about Djibouti and I confirm my finances and we see if I can make it to Djibouti because I'm told it's pretty, pretty expensive. I don't know about that. Um, greetings to one and all. Hey, Mama Africa, you've been a big supporter of mine. Hi, someone typed in Amharic. I can't read Amharic. I'm sorry. The steam conjo has offers on her table for husband. Oh, really? It seems you enjoyed life in Ethiopia. Yeah, I like and I love life in Ethiopia. Na Coca in Ethiopia, one of the best. Coca Cola in Ethiopia is the same as Coca Cola in Kenya as the same as Coca Cola everywhere because i even think it's the same company no boyfriend yeah no boyfriend is there any lockdown in ethiopia no there's actually there's actually no no lockdown uh there's no lockdown there's no curfew we wear masks in expensive places just that in ignore and ban the people bringing politics to your channel if you want to learn more ask the people in the ground yes Yes, she's from Kenya. Do you have boyfriend for Ethiopia? I'm yet to get one. I'm yet to get one. Let's say that. How long will you stay on the live chat? As long as you guys want me to stay on the live chat and as long as I can keep talking. You should explore Kenya more. Oh my God, you have no idea. Check my Kenyan content, you will see. I have visited almost all cities in Kenya. For people who joined my channel earlier, they already know this, but I have explored some good percentage of Kenya. Uh, I'm from South Africa. If you're coming, call for me, please. Uh, thank you so much for joining my channel because by the time I'll be coming to South Africa, you will be informed. You look like Ethiopian. Thank you. Yeah, I have heard that from so many people. Have you been to USA? Waiting for you if you... If not, welcome. I've not been to USA. I just have so many good friends from the USA. I look forward to them. Uh, I look forward to visiting US. I look forward. Hello, good day, sweetheart. Hello, thank you for being here. Too sweet to be single. Yes. Your, su your super chat is broken? Pardon? 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 They said we go there? Yeah. Who? Huh? You? For charging? You want to come in? Yeah. Okay, okay fine. Okay, okay, okay. So you guys, I'm going to be walking to another place because I need to charge my phone for us to continue with this chat. Uh, your super chat is broken. No, it was working. What happened to it? It should be working. But if you want to support me, my PayPal account, damarisjenga, yt at gmail.com. Mm. 
Email, African Unity is Ethiopian. Do you miss Nyamachoma? Yes, I miss Nyamachoma, but I normally uh, eat the uh, meat. They are sort of Nyamachoma that is in a charcoal sort of thing. That's where I I do eat my Nyamachoma. I'm from Dallas. I love to watching it. Thank you very much. Hey, girl. Hey, how are you? Thank you so much for being here. African Unity in Ethiopia. Yeah. So, guys, remember, I really ap apologize because I can't be able to really read your name. And the people that I am reading their names is because they have come to my channel so many times that I know their faces from their profile picture. And that's how I'm able to read their name. She is tourist. Why is people asking about politics? Unity Park is around the place. It's not far from Bole, but you must pay 500 brief for entrance. A whole 500 beer. You know, 500 beer is enough for me to spend two nights in Addis Ababa. Anyway, <laughs> let's not think about life like that. Uh, you look like my daughter. You have the same sleepy eyes. Thank you. Thank you very much. Unity Park is inside Ethiopia's palace and you will be impressed when you see the history. Trust me. Go to Redawa or Romia, my hometown. I will consider the entrance fee to Unity Park is only 200 beer. Yeah, that's pretty affordable. Unity Park, it has so many things like game zone and you can you can see Addis Ababa. Okay, you guys really want me to visit Unity Park and Entoto Park. I will do my best to try and visit those places. Trust me, don't visit Unity Park. You will only find... <laughs> you will only find trees there. One place you should visit is... Marcato, the biggest open market in Africa. It's an, I have heard about Marcato. The problem I have with Marcato, I can go to Marcato and visit the market myself, but I can't vlog there because I'm told it's not safe and my phone could be stolen at any time. So even if I go to Marcato market, I'm sorry guys, I can't take you along with me. If I had like a GoPro, that way it's easier and it's not uh, exposed to people and they don't see like a phone a phone screams and be like still me that's what a phone does when you like lift it up yeah she's reserved for my cousin oh my god you guys even reserve me for your cousin just kidding guys yeah 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 you better tell them i send instagram message please read it thank you i will read it immediately after this live i will reply to all of you guys if you come to dallas usa welcome to invite my family house african unite thank you very much greatly appreciate did you visit Simeon Mountains? No, I did not make to visit Simeon Mountains. This is why, guys, a video is coming to you of a mountain I visited in Lalibela. And I walked for continuously for three days. My legs were very tired. My shoes tore. I actually don't have shoes as we talk right now. And so that way, I was not prepared to go to Simeon Mountains. You get me? Do not go to Marcato by yourself. Okay, I will not. You can vlog with a cameraman. Yeah, Aleph, I will consider that. Just that it's more money. I will consider how much African countries have you visited? Are you planning to visit all of them? Yes, my goal is to visit all African countries. So far, I have visited six African countries. Yeah. Oh, don't go to Marcato alone. If I go with someone, I can vlog. No problem. Okay. Because many people have told me of how not safe it is. Marcato is Washington of Ethiopia. Don't go. <laughs> wow. Cut, that is the best joke I have ever seen <laughs> in a long time. Wow, wow. I think Aleph at this rate has so many cousins. And majority of you guys are one of them. GoPro, great idea. Yeah, I really am looking forward into saving up and buying a GoPro. And we will see. I get you, you have a bit a uh, fit day for Simeon, but it's worth it. Yeah. I really wanted to go to I really wanted to go to Simeon but it was not possible because I didn't actually majorly because I didn't have shoes not because I didn't have energy but because I didn't have shoes 
please visit South Ethiopia. I am on my way to South Ethiopia. Don't worry. Very soon you will see videos about South Ethiopia. Have you been to Piasa? Yes, I've been to Piasa. You see, I have done a video of uh, what 150? Is it 150? Is it 150? Yes. Wait. No. What? Uh, wait. I'm trying. Oh, what 15 dollars can get you in Ethiopia? I did a video about that, and because the room was 15 dollars, a video. I am. I am in the thumbnail. I am in my towel and sitting on a bed. I was in Piazza. That place is in Piazza. What did you study? I answered that, but I can repeat. I will visit. Uh, uh, huh. Did you did you study? I studied computer science, mathematics, and computer science. Uh, how are Ethiopian guy? I think they their stuff is smaller than Kenyan guys. Lol. I don't know about that. I don't know about that unless you search on Google or you ask Ethiopians who are informed about that. <laughs> how much does a GoPro cost? A GoPro cost. Like the latest GoPro is, you can get a GoPro from three hundred dollars to five hundred dollars. That is the range. So for me, is uh, yeah, three hundred dollars to five hundred dollars, depending where you bought it. Please come to Hawasa. I will come to Hawasa. Which country is going to be the next trip? I'm still deciding. If from Ethiopia, if I can take a road trip to Djibouti, that will be very very good. Another option for me that I'm thinking right now, I can take a road trip to South Sudan, but many people are discouraging that. So if that doesn't happen, I will go back to my country and head to Tanzania or to Uganda because I have missed my Ugandan friend and I also want to show you guys Uganda in a good way or I will go to Tanzania. So I'm still indecisive. Go to France, Lesson, Addis Ababa. They will host you there for free. You will use hospitality. Wait a minute. How do I go to France Legas Lyon Addis Ababa? How do I go there and they host me for free? You tell me. Send me an email or something. It, it, I just can't go to a hotel and tell them, you know, you, you guys, you know what? Someone in my chat said I can be hosted here for free. That wouldn't make sense. So, yeah. You see Gonda? Yes, I saw Gonda. I would appreciate actually that offer. I will really, really appreciate it. It would save me a few shillings. And we can be able to, to purchase a GoPro. Hello, where are you from? I am officially from Kenya. I am Kenyan, born in Kenya, lived in Kenya. My bad, I mean uh, Chicago of Ethiopia, not Washington. Oh, Chicago. Okay. I don't actually know the difference between Chicago, Washington, or even what you mean. Because I, I don't have so much knowledge that I would learn that... That is not what you meant, but thank you for correcting. Sweetie, be careful. A lot of dangerous places in Addis, even for us born in Addis. Okay, I will be careful. I try my best not to be out late. And like right now, because it's already late, I'm going to take a cab from here to my hotel. And that will be good. Did you want to go to Somalia? I like that. But try safe places. Somali people are so friendly. Okay, yeah. First, I'm going to try more stable countries as we agreed please guys hit the like button if you have not hit the like button it supports my channel go to tanzania gopro is expensive yeah a gopro is expensive but uh it's expensive but it's good it's good quality is it's good ferense legation is a whole area where exactly oh it's a whole area Damaris, yes, yes, yes. I hear Tanzania and Zanzibar is very nice. Yes, yes. Tanzania is beautiful. Zanzibar very beautiful. I can't wait to visit and show you guys the whole places. Chicago is the Aleppo or Syria of America. Okay. Is it warm in Ethiopia? Yeah, it's warm. Just that in Addis, Addis, not Addis, not the whole of Ethiopia. At this, at night, it gets very, very cold. Not very, very cold, but cold. In general, most Ethiopians are nice with outsiders. We just had between us, Ethiopia is the most safe place in Africa. If you go to Uganda, please visit Jinja. I have been there and so beautiful. Yeah, I want to visit Jinja because the last time I was in Uganda, I didn't get the chance to visit Jinja, so I will look into that. Beauty, thank you very much. Have a nice day and be safe. Yeah. Ethiopia is African mama city, you know? Oh, oh, I didn't know that. Actually, I finished my drink. 
let me put my drink so we can keep chatting do you have a boyfriend no i don't have a boyfriend i keep answering that question so many times i think i should do a, a video about meeting my non-existing boyfriend mm. is ethiopia in general cold or less humid than kenya cold not humidity but i, I visited a place another place in lalibela on the mountains that is where i experienced humidity but here it's cold the temperature is like low i am really enjoying your content damaris marcato might be a little bit crowded and it's really possible to lose phone there is no entrance fee in entoto should go early to see the whole place okay i don't know next month if you are still in addis the victory day or independence day is gonna be celebrated at the center of piazza you can be part of that you look a bit shy or nervous i look shy or nervous really at least I'm not shy or nervous when I'm doing a live stream. Because you guys cannot necessarily see me in real life, you know. <laughs> no, I, I, I cannot say I am shy or nervous. At times, uh, I just feel a little bit... Uh, I have a degree of shyness, but not that much. Ethiopian guys are the most handsome guys in all African countries, but their staff is super small. How did you know about that? How did you know about that? That's uh, that's creepy. <laughs> wow, that's so creepy, but okay, it's fine. I don't know. I don't know. I explore, but not that area. In real life, I'm not necessarily shy. I will be shy if... I will be shy if... When will I be shy? If you flatter me so much <laughs> or I avoid looking at people directly, that's something I will exp explain at some point. Even at some, at, some, at some time when I'm doing my video, I avoid looking at the camera directly. This is me exposing myself, okay? So I avoid looking at the camera directly, but like, like you see how I am looking at another place right now instead of looking at you. That's how I run away from my shyness. How old are you? We said I'm old enough. Uh, you don't have a boyfriend. I I'll cheer in you. I love you, babe. Thank you. Why are people keeping on asking you if you have a boyfriend? I think you must have said no a hundred. <laughs> Thank you for fighting for me, Mama Africa. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, haters on the live stream. Why are they hating on Ethiopia men? I know, right? I know, right? They should just be appreciating. How many countries did you visit? I said I visited six countries. I visited six countries so far. Yeah. I have visited six countries. And I love all the countries I have visited so far. There's something I have loved. The people I meet on these countries is what is more important. Because they are jealous or because they want to market themselves. Maybe. You never know. Yeah, so, mm -hmm. so that has been it. It has been interesting. The people I meet, I am always like, oh my God, I love you guys so very much. So, so much that I always miss to visit those countries and I hope we get connected. The good thing is they keep watching my YouTube videos if they miss me or if they want to know about my progress. But for me, I'm unable to catch up. It's a lot. I have not eaten Ethiopian, no, Somalian food, but I'm told Somalian food is not different from Ethiopian food. Maybe, maybe I, can, I can see if I can find an Ethiopian food. I also want to see if I can get a Kenyan food here in my country. No, Kenyan food here in Ethiopia. That will be interesting. No, it's uh, just jealous. Yeah, 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 yeah. I totally, I totally agree. I totally agree with that. And whew, I have not mentioned this, guys. We recently hit 7,000 subscribers. Yay, 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 yay. Cheers for that. We are almost actually hitting 7,500 subscribers. That is so good. I see, uh, cousin, I hope to see you at the wedding. Yes, Aleph, you are welcome to our wedding. Must be possible, especially in Addis. Everybody is shy sometimes, if you are shy. 
So what it's not a disability. <laughs> wow, I love Mama Africa. I just love you. I just love you. You're fighting for me like no one's business. Yeah, do not disability. There is people who are not shy and can't travel on their own. Yeah, and uh, well, you know, Ethiopians say God made our women after getting a hand wash, implying He made the men with a dirty hand. Oh, now you're getting so deep on the concept of men. Forget about them. Appreciate what you have and we move on. What insects were in Barda? Yeah, so I have not talked about that. Thank you for bringing it up. In Barda, there were mosquitoes. Not so many mosquitoes, but don't sleep without a mosquito net. Not so many mosquitoes, but don't sleep without a mosquito net. Hey, Damaris. Hey, thank you so much for joining. Lol. Mm -hmm. Fact is fact. I'm from South Africa and I found ghoul culture, but Ethiopia isn't clean city. I wouldn't say it's the cleanest city. I have been to Rwanda and Rwanda still has the crown for being the cleanest city. And that's why in my videos you've not heard me talk about the cleanliness. You have to send your elders first with dowry and stuff. Okay, where are you right now? You don't feel sometimes a bit lonely? Those night time outside Kenya some hug and nights are cold as you said. I don't really feel lonely. I don't feel lonely because I have never gone to a hotel stayed in a hotel alone for days i always try and look for people to talk to so even if it's the receptionist even if it's other travelers i make calls to my parents to my family i video call my sister for more than two hours at times i talk to my family and that way i don't get i don't get i don't get lonely uh, when i get lonely i try and find what do i miss about my country that is making me lonely. Like for example, there's a time when I was in Addis the first three weeks, I really missed meat. I really missed Nyama Choma. I was like, you know what? Please, let's just go somewhere they're selling meat. I eat meat and I ate and it was okay. So if you watch my videos more, you would see I normally eat French fries, like to take a break from injera, to have something that connects me and make, makes me feel like I am now in my home place. But now I'm a traveler who's traveled for some minutes, so. I'm about to travel. Hey, Margarita, I see you, girl. How are you doing? Where are you right now? Oh, I said I'm at Sapphire Hotel. And yeah, this is where I'm chilling. I can show you actually the hotel. This is the hotel. I'm drinking the Buna. It's a big, 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 big hotel. It's a five star. And like that. Oh. It's not turning back to me. Yes, so that is where I am right now. Mm, I like Somali food. They cook better than Djibouti. Okay. Is this a goodbye stream? It's not a goodbye stream. If I leave Ethiopia, I will do a goodbye stream. <laughs> that will be emotional because I have had a good time. What's your cash app? Uh, I don't have cash app. I just have a PayPal account. And it is damarisjengayt at gmail.com. Damarisjengayt at gmail.com. You can also text me on uh, Instagram. I'll tell you more ways you can support me. I really appreciate your support so much. Mzuri, hello, this is Amha. Hi, thank you so much. Is this a good... No, 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 it's not a goodbye. I like Somalian food. They cook better than each booty. Uh, she'll, she'll, any idea where I can get a good driak only online? Dreak? What's a dreak? I don't know what a dreak is. Thank you. No, I mean not lonely, but I mean what's some, want someone to have fun kind of adventure. It's all in the mind. I think it's all in the mind. It's all in the mind. How do you finance yourself for your travel? So today I was actually watching this conversation that other travelers were having and they were having a problem with people necessarily just asking other people how they fund their travels it's a good question if you're genuine others it's not a good question if you just want to gauge how much money the other person has so you can be like justifying yourself or something like that so i would say i make my money to travel from youtube and from good people who support my travel so that's how i make to travel i also said i don't buy 
I don't buy I don't buy things. I don't make my hair. I don't go to salon. I don't I just buy lipstick and I bought one after so many years so I don't buy shit. So yeah, it's very clean. You can also watch a video I did a whole story about how I make to travel. It's very clean. There are people hired to pick up litter in Addis. It's just a bit dusty and sidewalks ain't perfect. Sometimes you walk on that. <sighs> oh my god, we have another super chat. I'm about to cry. Oh my god, thank you very much. Uh, do you have interest to live in Ethiopia? I would live in Ethiopia actually. If I found like something for me to continue doing here, I would definitely live in Ethiopia. Yeah. How do you define lonely? There's some people who are married and have children, big family, and are still lonely. Yes, I would say lonely comes from an internal concept. It's not about having people around you. It's more about, uh, it's not being alone. It's, it's having a lonely feeling inside, which I don't know how to define it. Get boyfriend fair. Uh, you never know. Ethiopians are handsome. Yes, they are. I see you are new in the game. I wish you good luck. You seem a nice person. Thank you very much. I greatly appreciate. I am just trying to figure out uh, how I can make my life better in this YouTube street, you know. About cleanliness in Addis, I would say it is not as dirty. And yes, they do clean. I have seen people cleaning. But it is not going to be ranked among the most clean countries. Yeah. How do you feel when random people in Ethiopia ask you personal questions? I found that to be something unusual when you, when I was there. I would say I'm a very, very open person. And I am actually answering uh, questions to people I do not know. So, and it's more as in the internet than with a random person. I can answer a random person a question they ask as long as I feel it's still genuine and their interest is out of good interest and we'll answer them. Uh, but I will also think from why would they, am I safe wherever I am? I have like all those things I consider before I know what I'm supposed to answer the person, okay? And also listening to myself. So I would say there's more safety to respond to people out here than to people on the stream because you guys can come back to me after years and tell me you said this here in this live stream and maybe it was true or not true or something you know you get me so i find it easier in the streets than here kenya means i was in a fun aroma ah thank you i love mama africa that is so very true i'm always alone but i'm not ever lonely no kids no spouse wow <laughs> Hi friends and how are you? Hi, I am doing very, very fine. I am so happy to have all of you guys. We've been having a very, very good interactive chat and I always enjoy. Let your recommendations keep coming to me and uh, let's keep growing together. Let's, let's just have a good time and build a big community here. Are you from Nairobi or from the countryside of Kenya? I was born in Nakuru County. If you know Nakuru or if you're Kenyan, but I live in Nairobi now. You don't answer any questions. What questions do I answer? Like if someone on the street asks me if I'm from which country, I will tell them. That's a personal question. It depends what question also. Oh, you don't answer my question. What did you ask me? I'm very, very sorry. I missed it out. Please type it again. I will get to you. Or oh, you've been in relationship with someone before. I mean, not Kenyans but other nationality? If yes, which one? I have not been in a relationship with someone outside my country. Have I? Have I? No, I have not been in a relationship with anyone outside my country, just my country. And not so many people in my country anyway. People are so funny, yeah. Uh, you have the same jacket for such a long time. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. So if you watch my video on how I pack, you know I pack countable clothes, like clothes worth for five days. I can't say I'm a minimalist, but I pack only what I need because I don't need luggage because I don't know how adventurous my journey can be. So I avoid carrying a lot of luggage. So that's why you guys will see me in the same clothes until I am back to my country. And maybe we can find a brand sort of clothes. Uh, that I can be wearing and that way 
we will not have questions. Uh, yeah, so that's why I have the same jacket because I actually just carried two jackets. So this one and the, and the black one. And that's why you just see them in the videos. Uh, say for Diwani, thank you. He gave you $20. I said thank you. Oh, I didn't read his name. Duan. Thank you so much, Duan. I'm grateful. Other please try to give her super chat. Thank you so much. If you can, if you can, I will appreciate. Thank you very much. I saw some of you video. Please make sure you have very good shoe. Yes, I'm trying. I will have to buy a better shoe in the future. I will have to buy a better shoe because my shoe actually died. I think I'm interested on you. Lol, I'm not creepy guy again. Okay. Did you use any Kenyan mobile money that I can send to you for travel expense? Yes, I use M-Pesa. So you can use World Remit. Just hit me on my Instagram if you're really, really interested. Hit me on my Instagram. I will give you my uh, number or where you can send money. That is greatly, greatly appreciated in this channel because it, it enables me to drink a cup of coffee and Buna in five star hotel and use their Wi Fi and do a live stream. Yeah, so hit me up on my Instagram, Damaris Jenga underscore. How many countries did you visit? Oh, I answered this so many times. Six countries Kalenjin, Kukuyu, Masai, Luo. I am half tribe of Kikuyu and Masai. Alem Gizau, kind of road question. Alem Gizau, kind of road question. What question did you ask? Okay, forget about it. Uh -huh. and enjoy your time and trust the Lord he will help you all the way yes yes I trust the Lord are you charged tourist places yes yes like to get to Lalibela I had to pay 50 US dollars for me to get inside Lalibela church yes I am charged as a tourist uh, Go to Mar Mercato, you can buy anything you want for a good price. Okay, I will consider going there to buy some shoes. We love you, sis. You are so welcome, dear. Thank you so much. Uh, you keep on skipping my question. Why? I already answered. Where village are you in Addis? I am in Bole. Bole, 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 Bole. Your question was how old I am. And we answered earlier and we said I am old enough. Uh... When you enjoy uh, Buna at an international hotel, do you leave a tip? If yes, how much usually? Uh, so, uh, like for example, let me show you. This uh, Buna is 39 beer, okay? And it has a 10%, uh, 10 what is it called? It has a 10% tax. So I will pay something like 45 beer, okay? But I will give them like 50 beer and they will return me the five beer. So I might just decide five beer for you guys. So that's why I don't love coming to international hotels necessarily for my normal food. I'd rather go to local hotels. And there when I, when I tip them like 10 beer or even five beer, it's good money for them. But a big hotel like this, I, I tip them five beer. It's not necessarily like such a big money, you know. So... But I have to come here because I need the internet. So something like 5 beer, 10 beer. Or two. I have seen people do 20 beer and 30 beer. But we are here to get there. Mm. Contact me if you want to try Ethiopian stuff for free. Lol. Yes, I will contact you. The problem is how do I contact you? Unless you contact me. Because I don't know how else I can contact you from just reading a, a, a comment from you. So the only way for you to get to me or me to get to you... Is you guys getting to me on Instagram? I said Damaris Jenga underscore, write me a DM or on my email Damaris Jenga YT at gmail.com. It is just like you can read it Damaris Jenga. If you go on the description of my videos, you will find my email there. You will find it. It's still my PayPal account there. It's, it's good. You have that. You have everything you need about me. You have direct contact to me. That's wrong to charge fellow Africans to a research prices. Yes, 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 yes. Your molds are so clean. Your nails are so clean. It's a lie. They're not the most clean, but thank you very much. That was the video that picked my interest in Quindy Expert on how to pack. It was so funny. Also with Irina TL who packed half of her home. Yes, yes. And Kat, you, don't, you have no idea how much I have missed Irina TL. More reasons why I am considering to visit Ethiopia. Not Ethiopia, Uganda. I'm also in Bole, baby.
Okay, yeah, great, great, great. Uh, I am in Bole. You're gonna be Ethiopian favorite YouTubers with your uh, attitude. The only thing, ignore politics, the rest you good. Thank you. Yeah, I actually barely, barely talk about politics because I'm not an expert at that. Habari, Muzuri, Nashukuru, Umekuja, Kwenye live stream, Yangu. Oh my God, we have another soup chat. Thank you very much. We have a uh, winner tube. Winner tube, thank you very much for the super chat. I greatly appreciate it. Be careful your surrounding, please. There are good things, bad things as well. I totally agree. That is the same case everywhere. Sasa wewe na mimi. <laughs> oh, you guys can speak Swahili. Interesting. Where are you learning some Swahili? I should be the one teaching you some Swahili. Asante sana. Tunashukuru. I pay for your coffee. Thank you. Thank you very much. Great. I greatly appreciate. If you spoke Amharic, you would pay half or less. But still sucks to pay tourist prices. Those are for people from developed countries. I totally agree. Good looking out. Good people live long. Thank you. Are you in Bashda now? No, I am currently in Addis. I left Bahda, but I still have more videos for Bahda. I still have videos for Lalibela. You guys are going to vlog some of these adventures that I did. Today, no video because we did a live stream. So from tomorrow, continuous videos. So I have been thinking about this. Do you think me posting a video every day is a lot of videos for you guys? Or you're okay with watching a video every day? So if you want a video every day, please type a video every day. I will keep doing a video every day as much as I can. Yeah. Hi Damaris. Hi Kumbagai. Can you talk about the fashion friends in Bole versus Barda and versus Kenya? What are people wearing? So in let me talk about there's not much difference between in Ethiopia basically. And when we talk about natural wearing and how people dress, we dress the same with Ethiopians. Just that for Ethiopians, on they they have like these events. They do wear their dresses, and their dresses are like their Ethiopian fashion style, as you might have seen in the videos that I shot about Christmas and about Gonda, uh, the Epiphany. You saw the Ethiopian, and I even tried having like a scarf so I can try and match up with them. Yeah, but they they have these different beautiful African dresses. And I was told all Ethiopian ladies have that. But for us in Kenya, we don't necessarily have a specific type of Kenyan dresses that is meant for us. The dress that is said to be Kenyan is uh, is the suka, the Maasai that they, they tie themselves. But we don't wear that anymore, you get me? So that's the main difference. But in the, in the casual days, they wear normally. As you see me wear, it's the same way they wear. Uh, Ethiopian stuff for free. I think blue balls or blueberries is talking about the wrong stuff. Oh, really? Really? Oh my God! I don't. I don't want those stuffs. Those stuffs are not good for my health. My doctor told me that. Every day, please. Every day. That's one person saying every day. I uh, just when you notice she was in offended because she's cool like that. Uh, Dama, can you reach out to me today? I can reach out to all of you guys. Please leave me an email. I can reach out to all of you. But if only you leave me an email and you have something to say. Otherwise, I'm not able to reach to you. You know, I, how can I text you? How? Jomo Kenyatta star. Kenya stars. Okay. Yeah, Jomo Kenyatta was our first president of Kenya. Or in Amharika, Besha Kemis. Yeah, the guys wear jeans and uh, dress shirt is still the style in Addis. Yes, everyone wears jeans, people wear dresses, ladies wear trousers. Mm. Yeah. Let me know when you come to America. I am a tour guide. Oh my God. I already have a tour guide in America waiting for me to land in America. That is so good. Anyway, thank you so much. Yes, we have a chat earlier on email okay fine that's fine yeah yeah oh and okay okay i am going to reply to you immediately after this live stream no problem do not worry yes guys if you're joining now please remember to hit the like button it supports my channel then you guys i want to make a request if you can please 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 comment on my videos anytime you watch my videos please comment and i'm yet to get like confirmation if you guys want a video every day if you want three videos a week if you want two videos a week if you want one video a week let me know. Oh, I can be your guide in Israel as well. Thank you very much. Answer it now. What did he say? 
What did you ask, Miki? Please re resend your question. I have missed your question. Uh, when are you leaving Ethiopia and what is next? I am leaving Ethiopia pretty soon. And the next thing is continuing to adventure and continuing to see the beauty of Africa. As we, as we look for money to leave Africa and still see the beauty of other places and how people live life and, and just have our eyes opened and yeah. To be honest, Ethiopia is different from other African countries. Can you tell me which this is confu confused you most about Ethiopia? Oh my God, the language, of course. Of course, the language, of course. Of course, the language. Of course, the language. Let me know when you come. Okay, I read that. Tunakupenda na shukuru sana pia mimi na wapenda. To be honest, Ethiopia is different. We agree. I can be your guide in Israel. I thank you so much. And side now, Alem, don't worry. You okay? You don't need to. For your earlier question, haha. Thank you. Is anyone still worried about the COVID there, or have people moved on with their lives? Oh, people have moved on with their lives. Apart from like Addis, people try to put on their masks. Uh, but outside Addis, normal life. Nobody talks about COVID. Uh, please come back and visit. I come back where? I will come back. Which nationality you really want to marry? I don't know. I'm open to whatever the world has in store and whatever God or the universe. And whatever. I don't know. My soulmate could be anywhere. You never know. Did you go out in nightclubs? Yes, I did a night video. You guys, you watched that? Oh my God. Ethiopia. You, oh my God. You have to... You have to see Ethiopian dance anytime you visit Ethiopia. That is actually not a miss activity. You have to. What are you thinking starting business in Addis? I'm not thinking about starting a business in Addis. The only thing about business I'm thinking about is to look for what businesses can people do here in Addis. So if I'm able to find someone, uh, if I'm able to find someone outside, uh, not outside. If I'm able to find someone here who can give me more details for me to share with you guys about businesses we, me included, can do here, I will let you guys know. Uh, Miki, she said she has not dated outside Kenyan men before. This was your answered question. Thank you very much, Cass. Do you need a partner for your business? Uh, right now, I am, I really, I wouldn't say I need a partner because right now my business is about building my brand and branching out in terms of a business, in terms of uh, the brand so at the moment I wouldn't say I really want partner but I want people who support me contributors and yeah did you make friends with Ethiopian women yes I have a few Ethiopian women that I will become friends the problem with majority of Ethiopian women barely do they speak English so it's hard to make friends I guess I'm a tour guide too but I'm young and uh, handsome Okay, <laughs> from where are you? Do, where are you? Every day, maze, unani 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 bamba. Let me assume that's what you said. Ethiopia is never colonized. We have our traditions, culture, customs, and pure Orthodox religion. Yes. Another thing that I I never knew or I used to take for granted is thinking that every Ethiopian is Orthodox. I have come to interact with Muslims. I have come to interact with Protestants, and I'm like, oh my God do not just be do not as much as ethiopia is among the leading countries that are very religious do not think that the whole country is just orthodox have you met any nigerians there i have not met any nigerian here but i know nigerians can be found anywhere because nigerians are very aggressive i can guide you in addis ababa that will be very very good reach me out and i will appreciate we oromo want to keep our culture like japan and still be modern country we don't want to lose like some african or AA. okay you keep on scraping my question what is your question i'm from america in detroit michigan wow thank you so much if your question is how young i am i am old enough if your question if you have dated outside yes i have not dated i have not dated guys please support her by uh, but she is so nice. Thank you so much. Yeah, is someone backing you up? What do you mean by backing me up? What do you mean by backing me up? I don't get you. Is someone backing me up? What does that mean? Let me uh, make me understand what that means, and I will I will answer you. If someone is backing me up.
has your mouth leave her alone she's beating our country <laughs> okay don't be hard don't be so hard on him let us let us give him a chance guys can we get these likes to a hundred likes at least let's let's get these likes to a hundred likes yeah so i was also talking about you guys leaving me a comment on my videos if you leave me a comment on my videos it triggers the algorithm and it thinks oh this person liked that video that's why they commented that's why they liked the video let us share it to other people and that way we can build a very very big community and i will greatly appreciate if you can share please share thank you very much and uh jamaicans are who i find everywhere if i feel like i am missing good good i look for jamaican restaurant to eat uh yes i i have found many jamaicans here Oh my god, talking about Jamaicans, Ethiopians are big fans of Jamaicans, they even believe about things to do with Hela Selassie, maybe with time I will get someone to explain that, but there is a big connection between Jamaica and Ethiopians, it means you are getting help, am I getting help from, I am getting, I would say I am, I am not necessarily getting help, but I would say I am getting support, does that count? What would you call someone super chatting? Is that help? I'm getting that. Do people know you are a foreigner or do they just come talk to you in Amharic? They come and talk to me in Amharic most of the time. And then I have to be like, what's your sign? And then they're like, oh. And then I'm like, tinish, tinish, Amarena. And then they're like, oh, you don't understand Amharic. So if they know English, you speak English. If they don't know English, we don't talk. Uh, I am just curious. You like Ethiopia? Yes, I like Ethiopia. Yes, I like Ethiopia. Um, uh, do people, okay, okay, okay. How is the food there? I like the food. I like the food. Do you eat fufu and do you know how to make fufu? I have never eaten fufu. The only Nigerian and Ghana food I have eaten is jollof rice. And shout out to Nappy Briggs, if you know him. He's a Ghanaian YouTuber. When he visited Kenya, he... He cooked for me jollof rice and I actually have that video on my channel, you can check it out. And I had a good time. Yeah. Do you eat fufu? Yes, I will eat fufu when I get to you for to the Western Africa. West Africa. And did you visit Shashemene? No, no, I did not. Why is that? So many languages, even I'm getting confused and I'm Ethiopian. <laughs> Hi Dama. Hey man lucky. Thank you for having you here. Great to see you doing fine. Thank you very much support thank you for very much my parents are jamaican but i was born in england so if you're talking about support uh it can only come from maybe my parents if you're talking about my parents no i don't receive support from my parents i'm already a big girl i should be looking for my own ways i should be the one supporting them now uh i receive so much support i would say from you guys i would not say it's help it's it's love it's extended love i would say jamaicans are interested in us or not in us not us ah great love the way you say tinish tinish amarena killer <laughs> yeah i like saying it too i'm in love with your smile damaris thank you very much uh go to diridawa okay i will consider how often do you call your parents are they worried about you no my parents actually really pray about me uh, pray for me they support what i do uh they are my biggest fan they always call me and tell me oh you 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 have these views you have these people who like your videos you have this comment they watch all my videos that i'm forever grateful and shout out to my parents for watching this hi how often do i talk to them as often as i can at least they also get updates about my life also from uploading videos i keep them updated before i try and go to places i don't have internet and so that way they don't have to worry about me uh yeah I, I i talk to my parents often are you vegan oh kat are you vegan i highly doubt kat is not vegan not at all can you make fufu i don't know how to make fufu Haile Selassie was the first empire of ethiopia he gave the jamaican who believed in him a town called shashemene exactly now you you bring the correlation between Mm, Ethiopians and Jamaicans. If you are comfortable with cold weather, please visit Debre, Bahan City, 130 kilometers from Addis. Okay, I, I will consider that. How was your visit in Gonda? I loved Gonda. Just that I visited when there was like this whole celebration. Yeah, but I liked it. 
some people be asking two personal questions lol guys please just chat friendly don't be flirty it is uncomfortable yes oh my goodness thank you for stating that out no don't go to diredawa stay safe okay is the city around addis which is many jamaicans or rastafarians living oh i would want to go and see that i can't think of anywhere that i have been where the love for jamaican were not great excellent respect globally yeah and start i answered the question someone asked if you're vegan and i was like you cannot be vegan we already had long conversations about meat at the moment you are in which city i am in addis ababa i am in addis ababa right now i am at safaya addis hotel is bahda at this point the best city in ethiopia no 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 that was my opinion that bahda is the best city the best city so far According to many people, the Willa Greer Addis Ababa is the leading city that is loved. When I visited Ethiopia about five years ago, I visited Addis Ababa, Shemanie. I met some beautiful Ethiopian people. Wow. Great. Yeah. Ethiopians are great people. Ethiopians are so good. And I'm grateful. So I am looking forward to visiting Awasa. That's the one place I'm so sure I want to go to. Because I've been told I will love it more than I loved Bashda. Because it has like a good weather. And they have a lake. And I can swim. <laughs> oh my god, I have missed swimming. <laughs> I'm about to cry. Don't ask me why I don't go to swimming pools. It's not so interesting to just go to a hotel and there's a swimming pool and that. But if I had one where I was staying, I would... Maybe. But also, most swimming pools had been drawn out water like even in hotels because of covid yeah awasa is amazing please to another shoe i have visited the north i think that is enough content for the north the content i have is enough content for the north yeah last question before we end this live stream do you have any more request of specific videos you would want me to do leave me that i will definitely do that you will get the owners of me doing the video and you're almost hitting a hundred likes so if you've not hit the like button please please hit the like button please have you seen any hyenas i'm yet to see any hyenas in ethiopia i've seen hyenas in my countries in my country another reason i've been told about that so many times but i am not so keen in in seeing hyenas because Let's just say I'm not very, very keen with animals. I am more keen about lifestyle and how people live. Ethiopians are not good for each other. That too, I have seen that. An aspect of that, not fully. Henok Quindi is correct. I eat alligator, pigeons, ostrich, also vegan foods. Yeah. Hello. Oh my God, we have another super chat. Thank you, guys. Haile Selassie visited Jamaica in 1966. That is the year when a lot of Jamaicans converted into Rasta. Okay. Go Africa. I love Ethiopians. You're doing a great job. Thank you very much, Black Cat 66 Logic. I greatly appreciate. You want to see hyenas? You have to go to Adama. Okay. I will consider going there. No, 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 no. No empty promises. Please, no empty promises. So... I don't even know where Adama is, but I've been told about I can go to places where I will feed hyenas with my mouth, which I think that's interesting. It's like almost, can I send you money? Of course you can send me money, please. Please send me money. I need to pay for my accommodation. Anyway, yeah, please send me money. <laughs> wow, that's so good of you. Yeah, send me money. However you want to send me money on my Instagram, talk to me. Jamaris Janga underscore and I will give you my number how you can send me money directly so yeah anyway what was I saying if you want to see only hyenas go to Adama there is nothing else there how can you send me money uh, you can send me money directly you can send me money via super chat also you just use my name Damaris Jenga, just talk to me on Instagram. It's easier that way. Good let's buy super chat direct now. Or super chat is still okay. Feed the hyenas with your mouth. That's Haral City where you can feed. Oh, that's Harar. I'm sorry, I won't make to go to Harar. I won't make it to go to Harar. I'm sorry. Can I tell you guys something about super chat that you might not know? 
when this will help you this is not actually because of me and because of uh, like because I want you guys to send me a super chat but also for your knowledge as you continue supporting other people uh, as they do this when you send someone money on super chat youtube takes foot it is 40% of that youtube takes it and then the creator receives the money after one month so i just thought you should know so if you really want to support like me today and say like today about that cup of whatever just get directly just come directly to me and i will have the whole share yeah so i won't have to share with youtube Anyway, that's just a tip as you continue supporting other YouTubers. Thank you so much. But if super chat is what is more convenient for you, keep super chatting. The money will still get to me. Uh, you should also visit Asmara and Ama Masawa in Eritrea. What did I skip? When you drive to Awasa, you can make stop in Shashamehe. It is on the way. Okay, I will consider doing that. I will definitely consider doing that. Uh, just came across your vlog great content thank you very much i appreciate i am so grateful thank you guys i am so happy and i appreciate do you have uh, a chrome account is that a chrome account a Ch chrome account no i don't have that account yeah that is not is is good way karibu every time she gets a super chat we all get a kiss really because she comes <laughs> Kat, I see you, I see you <laughs> ah, Because she comes in so close to read the meme <laughs> Come on people, go, go, go <laughs> Yes, YouTube deck takes so much of, of that money <laughs> ah, Oh my god You're very funny <laughs> Uh, I would truly love if you would share us with another video about the adventurous, sad times, exciting times experience you had in your travels. I will definitely do that. As I said, uh, how can I send you money today? The best way for me to receive money here in Ethiopia is Western Union. That is the best way. Tomorrow I will just report in the bank in the morning and give them the MTCN number. And that works in every country with no worries, with no struggles. And all you need is my full name. Yeah. So that way it's easier. Very easy. And tomorrow I'll have the money. Thank you. So for you to easily do that. The other easy way for you to do that, just hit me up on damarisjengawaiti at gmail.com or uh, on Instagram. If you're not on Instagram, how else can I help you? Just type me on email. Yeah. If you watch any of my videos in the description box, you will see my email address you're scared of me that is why you don't want to answer it what question is this that i haven't answered what is uh, can you guys help me out i uh, have a good day or evening thank you very much very interesting filming you show the best side thank you thank you very much there you got more kisses <laughs> ethiopians are good for each other and for others too they are known for their tight social bond and living together within different religions and beliefs. Do you agree? What is your Facebook account? Damaris Jenga. If you want to find my Facebook account, you have to write Damaris Jenga YouTube. And that way you'll be able to see my account. Because there are so many Damaris Jengas, okay? So, <laughs> did I just say Damaris Jengas? Uh, so there's Damaris Jenga and then you add YouTube, you search, you will find my name. Thank you. Thank you guys. We hit 100 likes. Kisses to you. What is your email address? My email address is Damaris Jenga, D A M A R I S, that is Damaris. Jenga is N J E N G A Y T at gmail.com. It's just that I keep trying to type, but I'm not able to type. So I keep trying to type, but I can't type. So if you, if you know my email address, please type it for me. I will appreciate. Please show us everywhere you go in Addis. I miss my city so much. I will try my best. Send me Mandazi. You want? Send me Mandazi. Is that what you say? Please, is there any possibilities to help kids, uh, to help them like school fees like that? Yes, there's, there's so much possibilities for that to happen. Actually, you guys have not seen. There's a video I'm going to upload for you uh, about a family that hosted me. And when I think about it, I'm even about to cry because that day I didn't know where I'm going to sleep. Like, 
I was just trying to figure out I was just trying to figure out where I'm going to stay and they took me in not because they had the majority of money or anything and if one day I can be able to help that family oh my god I will definitely do that I am trying to type but I can't type I am trying to type but I can't type I've been I've been trying to type for some time but I can't I can't type Yeah. I can help them. Please do if you get my how to write my name Damaris Jenga as is the name of the YouTube channel and then you add y and a t at gmail.com. Please type it for me. I will appreciate. Yeah. So basically that's it guys. We've been here for 1 hour 45 minutes. That is crazy. Yeah. That is crazy. But if you don't find it in every of my videos in the description box, I have my email address down there. So, yeah. I can't. I'm trying to type. I can't type. I'm trying to type. I can't type. I am trying to type, but I can't type. You see the way you wrote Damaris? Now you write Jenga. And then Y and T. I'm going off and waiting for your response on the email. See you soon. Much love. Thank you very much. I will definitely get to you. I'm also almost about to end this live stream. But before that, oh, the problem is uh, you can't type it. Let me make you a moderator for you to be able to type it. Uh. Now, uh, solo B, please retype it again. Always be careful whenever you go. I will be careful wherever I go. Please retype it. No more super chat than sharing with a billion dollar company. Taking 40% is crazy. Yeah, taking 40% is crazy. It's crazy, but at least I still get the 60%. So no worries. What about Kuchumbane? Send me that, okay? You answer my questions. Kuchumbaria? I don't know. Yes, at Gmail. Yes, thank you. Damaris Jenga YT at gmail.com. Here we go. Uh, let's see how we can. I don't even know how I can, but that is my email address. So helpful and kind you are. I will mail you. Don't forget me. I will mail you for sure. Hi, sis. Hey, someone don't. Some people are still joining the live stream. You're very lucky that I'm, I'm not yet ending the live stream, that you got a chance for you to join. Hello, joined in a bit late. Yes. Hey, Naomi. Thank you so much for being here. Glad to have you. Other than you are doing way good. Nice talking to you. Thank you. It's been a pleasure talking to all of you guys. I can't even believe I've been here close to almost two hours. But I'm happy and glad. I always enjoy connecting with you guys. Hi, Joseph. Thank you so much for being here. I greatly appreciate it. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah. So it's been good. What's the topic of discussion? Are you living there or no? Uh, we were basically talking about life in Addis Ababa. Uh, as I continue answering people, some of the questions they might be having as I read what people have to say. And just here, am I living here? I have been here now for more than, for two months actually. Wait, what is the date today? Yeah, I've been here now for close to two months. And... Uh, um, I will see how long I'll continue staying here. Sasa umepotea, niko salama kabisa. I am doing very well. Hey, I subscribed your channel today. Would you come in Adama? Where is Adama? Let me know. Thank you so much for subscribing. Welcome to the family. Feel at home, feel welcome, feel loved, and feel appreciated. Go to Sha and interview the local Jamaicans. That would get a lot of views. I will actually consider doing that. You can get a job there as a teacher of English. I don't want to be an English teacher, really. I want to be a, a YouTuber. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> zero two zero four twenty one. Yeah, so today is being zero four. I am I have been in Ethiopia for fifty eight exact days. Yes, I must go and deliver people their products that they have been waiting for. They will not understand I have been live chatting. <laughs> 
I get you. I get you, Kat. Thank you very much. Yeah, you've got to go work. Thank you very much. I'm also about to end this live stream, but it has been a good one. Thank you so much for anyone who's joining. See you later, Queen. See you guys. Damaris, you should block some disrespectful chatters here. They might be spam and keep bothering you. I get you. Do you have the address of this family where you speak? Then you spend the night. Yes, I have the address of the place, the people where I spent the night. If you have any question, my email address has been dropped down. You can contact me. I will keep answering you. Wow, we Ethiopians, we love you. Thank you very much. Adama is 98 kilometers from Addis Ababa. Okay. We hear Ethiopian ladies are very cute. Please, Tuonyeshe. You got a bit drunk now. Oh my God, no, it's a lie. This is what I have been drinking. This is what I have been drinking. This is non-alcohol drink. So how did I get drunk from this, yeah? Please keep it. I will mail you. Okay. Yeah, so guys, it's been an interesting one. Thank you very much for being here. Uh, it is going to be a very, very long one. And I always love challenging my sister and seeing if she catches up on my live stream or any other person. Let me know in the comment section if you watch this live stream again. You, you you love me so much. Thank you very much. Yes, Damaris Janga, that's my Instagram page. Yes. So, my sister, I hope you came back to watch this video. If you did, uh, type down there, Buna. Let me see if you know how to pronounce Buna. Yeah, and guys, thank you so much for being here. I love all of you. We love you, old girl. See you tomorrow. As you said, I will try my best and upload videos every day as much as I can. When I don't upload videos, just know I didn't maybe get internet because I have a lot of content and stories to share with you. So stick around and let's keep growing. Cheers to 8,000. Heading to 10,000. Share this if you can. And guys, bye for now. I love you so much. Thank you so much for the super chat. Thank you for so much for everyone who's been watching from the start to the end. And I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. Take it easy, respect and bless. Thank you so much. I love Mama Africa. You have been a big supporter for me. I greatly appreciate. I will see you next time. Bye for now. Good night or good day or enjoy your time. For me, it's good night. Bye. Love you too.